minute. I haven't done this, but I hope you still love me. <laughs> because you know when I come, I come good. I make sure and give you something fabulous. So today, we are going to make something that is just oh, over the top. We're gonna take it back home. We are gonna do something that is amazing. Can you guess? Can you guess? What might I be doing today? I have some coconut grated that's out. There's brown sugar, a little bit of spice. So what are we making? <laughs> welcome, welcome. If this is your first time, welcome to Spice Isle Cafe. And today we are going to make sugar cake. Oh my goodness, some sweetness in the place. I hope all are ready because I am ready to get started, okay? <laughs> so I am going to put, now you want equal parts. Again, I already have, um, I know you guys probably wondered, I, I should have said that I have a little fancy tool today. <laughs> I'm doing everything in the same spot so you don't have to feel like, okay, where's Carol going today? Everything is right here. Okay, I have a fancy stove, cooktop, whatever you want to call it, so I can, you know, be engaged and stay right here with you, all right? So I have some water boiling. I am going to add my coconut that I grated earlier in the pot. Ooh. Yes, sir. Now I have about a cup and a half coconut. So when you're making sugar cake, and I'm not, I'm making it with brown sugar. <laughs> so you want equal parts. I have you know, a cup, cup and a half of sugar. So you want a cup, cup and a half of grated coconut and you want the same amount of water as well. And then I am going to add a little bit of um, grated ginger. It's probably about a teaspoon grated ginger in here. And I need to have the, the, the aromatics. You know, you need to have the aromatics. <laughs> You need to have the aromatics, my people. And for me, or I should say for us, <laughs> is some cinnamon sticks and some bay leaves, you know? I, it was small, so I put two bay leaves in <laughs> the cinnamon stick. I'm gonna give this a stir, and then I may even have to add a little bit more water just because I put water in beforehand, so some of it kinda just evaporated. <laughs> so yes, I'm gonna have a little bit of that. I'm gonna have a little bit of this stirring in here. Listen, if you can smell <laughs> the goodness, the aroma going on in here, all of you would just fly to Texas, you know? <laughs> so look at the bubbly goodness going on. I mixed it up and I just let it just you know, just do your thing, do your thing. <laughs> so now what I am going to add, so you've seen the bay leaves, you've seen the, um, the cinnamon stick, you see how the brown sugar, I use light brown sugar. So I am going to add just, a, uh, you know, just a little bit of um, color to this. And you, now you're gonna ask, well, well <laughs> what color do you need? Now, I am not putting any color, um, you know, like red coloring or, you know, pink coloring or anything like that. I'm using some Grace Browning. <laughs> I'm gonna put a little bit of browning in this. Now, if you have molasses, that's something you can use as well. You want to get a little bit of color. Um, it just depends on the sugar you use and how much. Um, so I am going to, let me put a uh, teaspoon. Let me give a, just a teaspoon of that in here to give it a little color. If it's not coming to the color I want, I'll add a little bit more. But I'll say a teaspoon of this. And I'll stir. Yeah, listen y'all. So it's getting a little bit darker. That's kind of what I want. So a teaspoon worked. 
Yes, my lovely people. The thing with candy is you can't just leave it and go hang out and watch TV and come back. <laughs> you know what I mean? Or go in the backyard and play ball. Uh -uh. You need to tend to this, okay? So, all right. So, um, it's already, that's the color I'm looking for. So a teaspoon, boom. It changed the color. If you liked it the way I had it before with just the light brown sugar, no extra um, browning or molasses, you're good. That's fine. It's, it's your taste, your flavor. So I am gonna let it do its thing right here. Look at this, y'all. Look at this goodness. I mean, can you taste it? Oh, somebody, somebody stop it. No, I'm not sure if you're a fan of the mask. I, I was. <laughs> I was. So, okay, it's doing its thing. And the, you may ask, well, okay, Carol, how, how will I know when this is ready? You will see it start pulling away from the sides. You can um, test it with a spoon to see, okay, is this coming together? And then I'll show you how you put it down. So we're, 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 we're coming, we're coming to come. Not there yet, we're almost there. <laughs> we're almost there. So questions, comments, let me know. Have you done sugar cake? Have you done it with brown sugar or only using like pink or red coloring? What have you done? What would you like to try? Just let me know and I'll tell you. <laughs> I'll tell you if I've done it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Look at this, y'all. I am loving it. And you can see, because I am not doing this, um, on a huge scale as I did in college. <laughs> I used to do this in a big pot, y'all. But, you know, it's just for your home use or for friends, you do this in a medium-sized pot so, you know, you don't go overboard with the sweetness of the day. <laughs> I know I can. So, um, just in a medium-sized pot, you don't need a lot, a cup or a cup and a half of coconut equal parts sugar and water and you know you throw your spices in there and in a few minutes you can see it all bubbly and coming together and just a bunch of goodness <laughs> yes oh my goodness listen this is doing its thing it already start pulling away remember this is sugar cake but with brown sugar i have my little testing testing things here <laughs> so it still need a little time it's a little soft because i want when i put it down that you can just whoo I'll, I'll taste it i'll do a first first taste y'all <laughs> oh all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. let me tell all you this is some goodness eh? That's why I can't make a lot because <laughs> I take my sugar. I have to watch the sugar, y'all. So, I know this is coming together as you can see. It's, it's almost there. You know, while I'll be putting this down in, in clumps, you know. What I will do right now, because I'm almost at the end, is to add a little bit of vanilla. Now I know that's not a measurement. <laughs> Often my friends is, you know, always ask, well, Carol, <laughs> what's a little bit? <laughs> what's a little bit? I'm gonna eyeball a teaspoon, okay? Boom, done. <laughs> Woo! We just want some flavor up in here, as if we don't have enough. <laughs> Yes, I, my people, look at this. Oh my gosh. Mm. If you can taste this right now, but I think we're almost there. Once, as I said, you see it's pulling off from the sides. It's sticking to the, the, the pot. 
the pork spoon. <laughs> and then I am going to lay these down in clumps. Yes. So that we can have some goodness, y'all. I'm ready, I'm ready. Can you tell? Yes. I am using a non-stick pot. If you are using a, 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 a pot where it's, you know, just a, not a non-stick one, you may have to put a little bit of water again because it might come fast. So, not long again and we'll put these babies down and let it cool and we're going to have sugar cake <laughs> before you know it. All right? Alright my people, I turn off my stove and I'm starting to put down these beautiful sugar cake here for all you. Oh Lord, everything nice and sticky and looking good. So I am going to just keep putting this beautiful sugar cake down and then, you know, once it dry, we're good. So I'm just going to put, again, I'm using these teaspoons here, so I'm just going to like, Put it down. Listen, I can eat all of this right away. <laughs> but I'll wait. I will, I'll try to eat. <laughs> How about that? Oh gosh, all of them would not be the same size. It's only, only the, the household eating, so don't watch that. <laughs> don't watch that. <clears throat> I'm just laying all these beautiful goodness down right here. Look at this, y'all. Who can stop us? Oh, nice. Nice and sticky. Yes, continue to put this beautiful sugar cake down. Again, it's nice and sticky. I am just trying to get all this goodness together. Don't worry if it falls on the side or anything. <laughs> Is it we eating it? <clears throat> Look at this baby. Oh, can you tell? I have a little bit more left in the pot. Oh, yes. And then you leave it to cool before it's time to eat y'all don't don't do like me and try to eat before <laughs> i know myself i know myself so yeah just basically this is it you just leave everything to cool and then later on you can share if you want to share <laughs> or not <laughs> just eat all your stuff but then you have to have a lot of water i'm on the last little bit the last little bit in the pot, the edges are nice and thick and, oh, just so good. Yes, my people. So let me just put this one down here with the palette. Ugh, that's great. Now, if you're like me growing up, once my mom, she's a guru for making candies, um, did candies, I'm, I'm the one that goes in the, in the pot and like scrape the, the leftovers. <laughs> So I'm not putting this away. I'm, you know, I'm going to have some of this right now. And it's going to cool. You're going to get a picture of this afterwards. I hope that you will try it. Remember, equal parts. This was the sugar cake time recipe. I'm happy that you spent a little time with me. Check out my live and make sure that you... What do you need to do? <laughs> Press like, share, leave a comment. Until next time, one love my people.